Hey everyone, it's Michael here from goodyreader.com. Rakuten Kobo is the global number two player in the e-reader space, right behind Amazon Kindle. You can probably buy Kobo e-readers in over a hundred different countries and a myriad of different languages worldwide. So they have a lot of things going for it. They're the only e-reader that has overdrive integration, which that means is you can borrow ebooks from the public library. Overdrive is probably the largest company that's involved in powering the audiobook and ebook catalogs of the public library in North America and Europe. Pocket integration, all you need to do is install a pocket browser extension for most popular browsers, and you can send articles directly to the Kobo and read them in ebook friendly formats. Kobo allows you to do a lot of things such as font weight, a lot of advanced features that no other e-reader has. Now there are some drawbacks to Kobo. The e-readers are notoriously slow, sometimes laggy, and other times a new e-reader may have staining on a screen and there's really nothing that you can do. You can't actually reboot the e-reader. And if you let the battery drain, it's pretty well once it boots up, so it's stained again uh, with this ghosting image that really doesn't do anything. If you're outside the warranty, it's basically a paperweight. Uh, the Kobo Sage, the battery life is super paltry. It's like a thousand milliamp battery. You should get about a week or less out of that. It was so bad that Kobo actually released a secondary case for it that actually has a built-in battery. So that's how bad it was. Kobo customer service is pretty abysmal. So what are the things that you don't like about Kobo e-readers? They're, they're tremendously popular and it's pretty easy to buy one directly through the Kobo website in a country of your choice, through bookstores, electronics chains, and even secondary markets. So let's uh, leave this up to you guys. What don't you like about Kobo e-readers? Drop a comment below and for goodyreader.com, my name is Michael. Everybody take care. Thank you.